Welcome to my channel. This video is for Dollar Tree Easter Wooden Bunny and Chick. If you haven't done so, please subscribe and tap that bell for notifications on my uploads and live streams. These each come in an 8 pack, so you can get an 8 pack of chicks and an 8 pack of bunnies. Now I take these sponge brushes and I cut the ends off to make more brushes so I'm not wasting a full one every time I paint something. So I'm doing this brighter yellow and brighter pink. A little bit darker. They're not really dark but they're not pastel colors so they're going to be a little bit brighter but some of the deco mesh I got for Easter is brighter in colors so that's why I'm doing it these colors. And I'm doing one quick coat on the front and then I will do the sides and I'm going ahead and painting both sides just in case they're hanging at an angle or something and you can see both sides I wanted to make sure and get them painted good these are going to go in some Easter wreath kits and this is just one way I'm painting them there are so many fun things you could do with these I had an idea that you could do like a grandma wreath or you could do a wreath for your own house and you could cut vinyl or maybe even scrapbooking stickers and put your kids or the grandkids names on each one of these and maybe do a little wooden uh, plaque you can buy little wooden rectangular shapes or different kinds of wood shapes at Hobby Lobby and um, Michael's and even Dollar Tree has some now and you could put vinyl you could put like Mimi's chicks or Mimi's little bunnies or uh, our our little chicks or something like that and then you could put the kids names on each one of these and attach them around a wreath or you could take an old picture frame and attach them around the picture frame and do the same thing so you could do some really fun things with these and um, you could put little bows on them so you could put a bow like a bow tie so it looks like a boy chick or a boy bunny and then you could do the little bow like a cheer bow on the top so it looks like a girl bunny and I actually have done that on another one I'm gonna have another quick video showing you a different way that I decorated them so this is just one way again and I'm making sure the side is done well and you can see these sponge brushes have a point so I'm getting in those little grooves with that point and it doesn't have to be perfect, you just want it to be a pretty good job so it's covered really good. And that top side, you can kind of tell the top side, it's a little bit more curved on the edges. And so I went over those twice. Thanks for watching everyone. I hope this helps you decorate and gives you some inspiration. Don't forget to subscribe, comment, share, like, and please be kind. Thanks.